Hello and welcome, I am Arumba. Thank you for joining me. We are on episode number 47 of Let's Play Defective Decadence for Crusader Kings 2. And uh, there's a problem battle here. Looks like England is actually trying to defend their territory, which is annoying. Why don't you just give me what I want? Huh? The pain will stop when you give me what I want. Need to pay attention to the invasion a bit. My little son, Prince Mubashir, always had his nose, or has his nose, in the Quran. What a bright little zealot. Well, I'm a hedonist, greedy, gregarious man. Let's just say, uh, sure. I think there's nothing wrong with being zealous, believing passionately in what you believe in. This battle's going to continue to be lost without a ton of reinforcements. And even then, he's reinforcing too. This army can take care of it, especially if we put some commanders in charge. Even people who hate me. Independence Faction is gaining some power now that I am uh, losing troops, so we'll give them some money. Anybody that uh, is not... Ooh, we've already done that. Okay. We're still at just one out of nine holdings, so that's good. This guy we could probably send a gift to and then convert, get him out of the faction. And this army will take care of England. This has already been fully sieged as far as we can, although it's currently occupied by somebody else other than me. So how about you guys advance up to there? That army I don't like. So actually, you guys can all head, all head there. It's a very messy way to expand, but it's also the most kind of time-efficient way to do it. Versus being stupendously tactful about it. And we will win all these wars. Mark my words. Dangerous Revolt has broken out. No surprise there. Captured some dude. That doesn't matter. Another pregnancy. How surprising. And that ratio just won't do, so we'll need to get some more men there. We've already won the war against this guy, so let's just do that. We've got the wrong holding in domain, so we can give away some land finally to these people who are causing decadence. So here, we will grant to you the Sheikdom of Reims. Rems. To you, sir, you get the Shwilia of that place. And that's pretty much as far as we can go from that war. But we're about to win these other ones, too. Can we get an organizer? Please? What is that? Desert expert. That's cool. I haven't seen that icon before. Organizer. Maybe he can make the difference. Okay, so this army is probably getting to be sufficient. Just disband those guys since they're losing. Getting chased. This army is doing nothing right now. We'll send it up there. This army is sufficient to assault with. Captured some woman. That's nice. England's still trying to fight back. And actually successfully running away, which I hate. Winning this battle will uh, most likely end this war. Oh, we've captured King Fast the Great! Wow. Um, we could ransom him due to our greed. Or we could just execute him. He's a Norse Catholic. Let's just do that. <laughs> and he'll still, still accept peace. I've just murdered your father, boy. You zero-year-old. Just as a spit in the face. Alright, who is the next most decadent person? This feels like a game of whack-a-mole. Already sieged through that, so we're getting a ticking war score there. He'll probably surrender on his own soon. This army's almost up in place. This army can continue to assault and then merge there. Other than that, Mali. I am not assaulting with yet, but we should be. We have the Pagan Attrition modifier here, so we're actually suffering tremendously. I need to pay a lot of attention to this. Yeah, 
Yeah, there's the surrender, as expected. Next most decadent man, you get uh, Loon. Not even gonna go look at it, there's no point. And uh, this attrition should probably scare me, but it doesn't. Can't raise any men yet to, to take care of that, because we're still currently fully raised. That guy is trying to take that land back, so... Yeah, we'll go over there real quick with that army. This army can assault. This army can go sit here. This army can move here to help assault. Combat is the best teacher. I have become a more proficient commander. Awesome. Alright, so now that that's done, that war will probably end on its own. Get that tick ticking war score. Scare the scare the guy. Another baby born. Independence factions at 60% now. Goodness gracious. I think it's time to shower the lands with money. Um, just to keep the realm together. Because I don't want to lose due to, the, due to the faction system. I want to lose due to decadence. Not that I really want to lose, but... That is kind of the point of the playthrough. Alright, so you, sir. Here's some money. Will you also convert? Good. You, woman. I've already, I've already gifted. I'll make you court musician if you stop it. This guy just, just hates me. He's ambitious, zealous, title claimant, infidel. Look at all those things. That's insane. Uh, can we just revoke your title then? Our Muslim administration laws. And let's just put him underneath somebody else. I will not allow you to steal my titles without a fight. Oh. Interesting. So you're actually going to try to fight me? That's weird. Well, let's just send this army down here then. He owns just lands over here. He was the guy that... Uh, Apparently, used to be the Catholic ruler in Italy. So we'll need to get some boats. And collect one of these armies. Let's bring these boats to here. And then do that. And then they should get there pretty quick. Okay, so let's try to wrap some of these wars up. Uh, we're certainly not going to lower taxation. Actually, it's on the, the burgers, which are the cities, so sure. I'm greedy, but we can't let them can't let them cause problems right now. Alright, that's good news. She's proud, like me. Um, let's see. Yeah, we could have more men if I were to... Yeah, the actual independence faction went away on its own somehow. Probably due to some of the bribes. Let's give out a couple more bribes though, just in case. Try to keep these people honest. That's fine for now. Oh, and I keep forgetting I've got an invasion down here I'm supposed to be taking care of. We are at 4% decadence from all the sieges and stuff, so that's nice. Um, and I think what we'll do is, just in general, they have they have pretty big darn things and really low supply limits, so we'll slow siege all this. Let's, um, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight provinces and 23,000 men, so that's about 3,000 apiece, roughly. That'll work, and, uh... I guess that's going to have to work. And we'll just miss one. But I don't think we'll have to siege all of them in order to win the war. So we'll just allow that all to happen. Um, I'm going to need to take care of that. This army will go siege through his capital first. Maybe capture his son. And then after we win this war... We will continue to see how Decadence continues to grow. So, yes, 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 a daughter, or a woman, 
Not necessarily a daughter, could have been a woman. Another present revolt that happens when you conquer tons of people all at once. That one we're actually losing, I don't like that. This one we're doing okay on. I had a feeling one of these wouldn't work. Can we borrow just a couple men? No. Borrow just a couple? I'm not gonna worry about it, those are sufficient. Probably to win the war. This army is suffering barely any attrition, so we're not going to worry about it. This army should be assaulting. Fortunately, they spawned right next to these peasants. So we can finish assaulting this holding. Go crush this guy's army. This is Bavaria. That's his his army. So we'll kill his army, reassault back what he took. That war will be over. Whew! Okay, there we go. Bavaria's done. We win that war. Who's decadent? Land! Land for everyone! You, sir. Congratulations. Abdullah, I've never met you before. You need land? Here's land. <laughs> Who's next? Do we need to create the Duchy of Colm? Yes, we do. Okay, who wants the Duchy? You? Okay, sounds good. Duchy of Colm. And I've already got two Duchies right now, so let's go find those. Susa. Are you family? Are you family? No? Do we have any family that can take it? There's one. Here. You're the, the, Dutch, the duke of this place now. And the other duchy that we have is Tuscany. Your family? Your family? No? Okay. Next, Kinsman. Congratulations. Emir of Tuscany. It's like, like imagine like you're at uh, like a birthday or something and you've never met half the people there and you're just giving away gifts. Congratulations. Here's a kingdom. Here's a kingdom. Here's a kingdom. Take care of those peasants. That that peasant army down there is the one that I'm kind of worried about. Not worried, but I just I have to take care of it. It will certainly be easiest to just kill the whole army. Alright, so one guy surrendered. That's good. Uh, my son Sadiq practically lives in the kitchens. Look at all these darn kids. And it's mostly daughters. So, I am greedy. I'm a military man. I say we... Birch him. Smack him in the face. And we can let prisoners go, they don't really matter. I mean we could we could ransom them, but who wants to mess with that? And actually, let's go get that army too. Alright, so we're winning every war. Um, the army against Galloway is uh, just sitting on that occupied territory will get us what we need. He'll surrender on his own soon. We're getting a ticking war score there. Mali is taking care of that peasant revolt. I just need to get an army over there. In fact, why don't we just leave behind a few thousand to guard it and then send this army to kill that one. And then this guy is... Uh, we're getting close on. We'll bring the boats around. Kill the remainder of that army. Well, I guess we have to kill it down there. Come on. Kill the remainder of that army, like I said. Now get on the boats. And where are your personal holdings? Up there. Okay, so bring these guys around then and drop them off here. And actually, he's got that army too. Let's just dock right on the army. My marshal just died. How sad. Family member, my uncle wants to... He's a pretty good guy. Let's use him. And this army we don't need to assault with because we're already kind of sitting on the war goal for the ones that matter. That one's about to end. That one's about to end. This guy, we just need to crush his army. I'm diligent. He's diligent. Crush his army. This is occupied by... Nobody that matters. It's not even our war. Capture some bishop. We will quickly... Chase his army down, and then go sit on his primary holdings. Get rid of those boats, because we don't need them anymore. Another daughter. My wife's pregnant, probably with another useless daughter. Okay, so Treviso and Verona will sit on those. I might split the army. Let's try to put that organizer that we found earlier in charge of this army, so that it can chase down the, uh, the rebels without any problem. Yeah, they didn't even try to run, that's perfect. And all we have to do is just kill the army, and then all the sieges that they did don't matter. Looks like we won the invasion of Mali, which means the decadence won't be an issue for a while. 
So let's uh, get rid of these things now. Okay. All right. Well, I will. Uh, I guess in the next video, we'll we'll actually give this land away now. Anything that we can, or create the duchies for, and then give that to family members again. Decadence growth is still at 0.8% per month, roughly, even though we've lowered it by 30% from wars and stuff. So I can keep the snowball going for a while, but um, it, it will it will end soon. So thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.